You remember the Bath Hotel? Oh, Lord, yes. Who owned the Bath Hotel? Who built Mac it? McAvoy, that first. Did they build it? I think so. You think they built it? Huh? That was Arthur's parents, was it? Yeah, right. Yeah. And were there many in that family, the McAvoys? There wasn't. He had, uh, the brother was the when they took over the pub, the daughter ran the pub. In the hotel? In the hotel. And uh, when a, an excise man came to Westport to stay in the, the, the corner where my prize is now, you know, there. Yeah. On the corner looking into the tide. That's where the helm is, is it? That's the helm, is yeah. it? I cannot think of the names now. Yeah. In, uh, in Dunnings. And in Dunnings. Uptown. Uh, Paddy Dunnings. On the corner. On the, the corner of the quay. Yeah. And uh, were you ever in the Bath Hotel yourself? I was, of course. And what was it like inside? Oh, it was grand. Was it, yeah? The, the, the heat of the water for you to have your bath. The heat of the water, that's right, yeah. The heat of the water was tough. Did you ever have a bath yourself? Pardon? Did you ever have a bath yourself? I used to have three a week in the month of September. The seaweed bath, is it? Seaweed bath. Were they good for you? So it left me that I could move for the winter. And did you have to pay for them or did you get them free because you were local? Oh, you paid for everything. And much Half a crown for a bath. Half a crown for a bath. What, what years would that be about? Uh, 1930s. 1930s. So you had three a week for September. The month of September a week. Mm. And would it be very busy down there? Yes, certainly was busy. Well, bit, really busy, yeah. And who would be down there? They came from Bell and Robe, Claire Morris and Bell. And would they stay there? They stayed there. Were and there many rooms in it? There was 11 rooms, I believe, in it. 11 rooms. And was there a bear in it? There was a bear. Nice bear? Pardon? A nice bear. Oh, it was well run. Well run. And would it be busy, would it run over the rest of the year now besides September? Would it be busy down there, would it? No, September, they come from June until the end of September. Yeah. And then they fold it up until September, until the following year. So nothing happened there all summer until June? There was nothing happening after, the, after October. Oh, yeah. And were, there, were the grounds kept around it nicely or were they, were they just the sea and the, and the shore? The grounds was kept and there was a short cut through the, from the Bath Hotel yeah. out through uh, the ground where the where Hall's Mill was. Yeah, short cut through there, yeah. Was there any music in the Bath Hotel now? Was there any sing songs or crack or...? Well, as in my hands time. If you went had to sing songs, I think you were in bad company. <laughs> so women and sing songs were bad for a pub, were they? <laughs> it's, it's totally different now. If you didn't have them, you'd have nobody in them. You'd have no one then. Nobody in them, yeah. yeah. So Josie Stanton, when did Josie Stanton take over at the Bath Hotel? In, in 1929, I think. So Josie took it over in 1929? And were there any changes made after that then? Or he left it as it was, did he? Well, I think he did work on the rooms. He did work on And did he run it himself or had he a manager in there? Uh, Theresa, the sister, uh, ran it. And you... Theresa Stanton. And where did she live? She lived with Josie and up the hill where Buffman Street. Up in Buffman Street. And would Josie be down there a lot himself? He would, I suppose, would he? Uh, on occasions, mm. and then... He was a farmer, was he, Josie? He was an RSC man. Was he? Mm. OK. Um, and the brother Michael was another. And was he a guard ever, no? No. RIC. And when did the RIC finish up? I suppose when the state took over in 1922. Oh, or? Must, must be in 1922. Must be that time, yeah. And did you, did you talk to Josie down the hotel when he'd be down there? You would have thought, you'd see him now and again. Oh, he was great. He'd boil the water for people getting meds and mm. what have you. Yeah. 
Sean told me he worked down there, Sean Stanton. That's where Sean Stanton first started. Yeah. He said he was down there working for Joseph, giving him a hand with the gifts and the water and the seaweed and all that, you know? The seaweed is right. Yeah. Where, the seaweed bath. Did they collect the seaweed around the area there, did they, yeah? They did, and they collected it at the back of the salt pens where I was. There was a plenty of it there that time? It was very plentiful. Is it still there? I think it is, isn't it? Probably, is it? But I couldn't, I wasn't back the key now for ages. Hmm. Where are the salt pens? The salt pens are behind the Keys pub, are they? Behind your pub, with the salt pens? Yeah, the salt pens was along the main road there. Oh, before you come to Clark's, is it? Around the bend? When you went to the White Gates, to mm. where our bear was. Mm. That was the salt pens. Yeah, the salt pens. And why does it call it the salt pens? Well, I cannot try and see that now, because that was before my time. Yeah. No wonder you used to take salt out of it. They might do. Mm.